A phoneme is the shortest unit of sound. All languages use phonemes to create sounds. For example, the word phoneme in English has six phonemes. F, O, U, N, E, N. Phoneme. Now, all phonemes are either voiced or voiceless. A phoneme is voiced if the speaker vibrates his or her vocal folds. A phoneme is voiceless if the vocal folds do not vibrate. An easy way to see if a phoneme is voiced or voiceless is to put your hand on your throat. If you feel vibration when saying a phoneme, it is voiced. If you don't feel a clear vibration, the phoneme is voiceless. To make a sound voiced, you need to add vibration from your vocal cords. You can do this simply by adding a humming sound. <laughs> Let's look again at the first and last sounds of the word phoneme. And mm. The vocal folds vibrate for a voiced phoneme like mm. The vocal folds do not vibrate for a voiceless phoneme like f. English and Spanish share many phonemes, but each language has phonemes that do not exist in the other. Let's focus on seven of the most difficult English phonemes for Spanish speakers using what you already know about phonemes in Spanish. You already know the phoneme because it is the same in Spanish. For example, it comes at the beginning of the word serpiente in Spanish. Now, to make the phoneme, start with the exact same sound and simply add vibration from your vocal cords. We see this phoneme in many English words such as zipper, fuzzy, and nose. Note, for this phoneme, we do not want any hissing snake sounds. Instead, you need to make a sound like a buzzing bee. In Spanish, the sounds for the letters V and B are very similar, but this is not true in English. The letter V is more similar to the letter F. To make the V phoneme, you need to start with the sound, as in the Spanish word familia, for example. Once you have the F sound, simply add vibration from your vocal cords to make the V sound. We see this sound in many English words, such as voice, heavy, and above. Note, your top teeth should slightly touch your bottom lip when making the V phoneme. The J phoneme starts first with the CH, which is often written with the letters CH, for example, in the Spanish word chico. Once we add voice to the ch sound, we get the phoneme j, j. We see this sound in many English words such as job, bridges, and cage. J, j, j. To make the sh phoneme, you round your mouth and push air between your teeth. It's like you're telling someone to be quiet. We see this sound in many words such as shoe and wish. To make the zh phoneme, simply add voice from your vocal cords to the sh sound. We see this sound in many English words such as vision and measure. To make the phoneme, you must rest your tongue between your teeth and breathe. 
We see this sound in many English words such as thin and help. To make the th phoneme, simply add voice from your vocal folds to the th sound. Th we see this sound in many English words such as this and brother. Note, if you cannot see your tongue between your teeth when saying these two phonemes, you are saying them incorrectly. Practicing in a mirror is a great way to be sure your tongue is in the right place.